Hello and welcome back to the Dynasty mode on Total War Free Kingdoms. Today, it is finally time to the much requested, and by much requested I mean it's been requested like twice, which is more than anything else. <laughs> um, the Wu Wei Shu Han uh, Emperors, essentially. Now, as far as I know, it was Cao Pi that uh, actually became, or formed, I guess, the Wei, I think it is. Um, and not Tsao Tsao, I think Tsao Tsao was already dead at that point, but Tsao Pi is not a uh, available character here. So we're going to go with Tsao Tsao himself, and then of course Liu Bei, and then I believe it was Sun Quan, not Sun Jian, because Sun Jian already died, and so had Sun Tse. Um, so Sun Quan, so we have three uh, Earth characters, we have no healing whatsoever as far as I'm aware. Um, so this is going to be fucking great, I'm sure this is going to work out absolutely fantastically. Um... Yeah, I mean, we can heal as in, you know, we can spend a point to heal fully. But it's not the most uh, effective way to use our, our stuff, I imagine. But anyway, that's what you guys want to see. I'm gonna I'm gonna play back on... No. Yeah, no. No, I'll, I'll, I'll stick to 100%. Why not? Um, and then we'll go back to... Uh, let's get Yang Zhao. Why not? Sure. Not entirely sure what we're gonna do after this one. I, I think I'm going to do a couple more, and then I think I'm probably going to leave this mode for a while. See if they ever add anything to it. So I, I, don't, I don't honestly follow it that much, but what I heard is that apparently CA has a policy of no DLC for DLC or something like that. Um, meaning that, for example, 8 Princes... Hey, we're shooting already. Good stuff. For example, Eight Princes will never get any additional DLC because there won't be any DLC for DLC. So you, have, you don't. There's not going to be any DLC that you have to purchase to make the DLC that you already have any better. Oh, we have free bows though. That's pretty good. So if that makes any sense. So as far as I'm aware, they they will not be doing that. Uh, which what I'm trying to say by that is me is that um, um, that means that oh even though this is free DLC or free LC. As far as I'm aware, they won't be adding any characters to this, which would be a bit of a shame, actually, because I kind of like this, and it's nice as it is, but I would really like to see the Yellow Turbans in here, because I feel like they would make uh, a fine addition to this mode. And then if we can get uh, the Eight Princes in as well, that'd be even better, but I guess we uh, shouldn't keep our hopes up, from what I understand. i to double speed this as well, by the way. Um, so that's a shame, but oh well. Right, speed and damage resistance. Yeah, that sounds like a pretty good deal to me. Melee evasion, of course. Alright, and I'm just going to do... Again, I'm not going for any kind of record, so I'm just going to play this one casually. I think, honestly, this mode at this point is more of a thing where I can just kind of chat to you guys and just talk about whatever needs talking about. Oh god, a full volley there. Um... Yeah, I can just I can do some do some chatting while we just run around and kill some stuff in the background. It's like it's like every single one of these videos is like an update video now. <laughs> and just talk about random shit, but um, not exactly. No, but anyway, um, yeah, I think I think this mode could definitely do with some some extra characters and and different abilities and stuff. Because one thing that I will say um, is that honestly, most characters feel too similar. There's nothing unique about them. I mean, they've got some unique gear and all that, of course, like, well, not, not everyone. For example, in this case, Cao Cao, you see him faster, going faster already. He has Shadow Runner, uh, like you would do. But then Liu Bei, for example, doesn't get um, Dilu, which is apparently his horse, um, which I've also heard since is a uh, bad luck horse, apparently. Everyone who rode it died in the end or something. Um, okay, so you've got um, that one. The other ones don't have that one available. We do have range block chance, so we have moving when... Okay, that's pretty good damage resistance when moving. Yeah, I'll pick that one up for everyone as well, actually. And then wildfire will be useful too. We have three yellow characters, uh, or earth characters. That's, it's not going to be great, honestly. <laughs> it's probably be even worse than the, um, the build we did last time. The let me ask you a question build. But that's okay. Again, it's just for, uh, for for shits and giggles. Um, so yeah, again, uh, going on holiday soon, which is why I'm recording uh, a load of these. I finished the, the, I think I already talked about this as well in the previous video, but I can't quite remember. I finished the, um, 
both the mod. Well, the mod tongue campaign has been finished for fucking weeks at this point. Well, not weeks, like two weeks, a week and a half, something like that. Um, and I finished the um, other campaign uh, with uh, Young, uh, Sima Young, much faster than I anticipated. Like, that was. Well, I, I don't want to say how many episodes it is because I don't want to spoil anything for you guys if you guys are watching it. Um, but yeah, it was done faster than I had anticipated by quite, quite a bit, actually. Um, there's two different victory conditions. I went for the ultimate victory one, and even then it took a lot less time than I thought it would uh, take. I should probably use my abilities, by the way. Not a bad idea, you know, seeing as that's how... That's one of the things that we do. Um, so yeah, basically the thing is I ran out of stuff to record too quickly, because normally I was going to, before I went on holiday, I was going to just uh, record a bunch of the campaign, and then, you know, that would last me... And some random videos. I would still do some of this as well, but... Oh, wow, he's already dead. Okay. Um, but I figured the campaign would last me much longer, but it ended up uh, not being the case at all, actually. Um, this is a buff, but only when you're not engaged in melee. We do want to get that. What do you get? Are we get anything different, or is it just the same shit for everyone? It's the same shit for everyone, just in a different order. You guys literally have it in the same order as well. Yeah, it's the same stuff. Right, we go for the insane, insane melee attack rate. Definitely want to have one of those. Uh, melee evasion, you get the charge uh, reflector. You get melee attack rate. I think we all go for that, but I want to spend the free points right now. Um, sure, let's get this melee attack range. Yeah, when we're above fifty, or yeah, when we're above fifty percent HP, that's fine. It's actually quite good when we're above 50% HP, it's just that we're not going to last forever above 50% HP. I'm actually surprised how much HP we still have, honestly. But yeah, um, I'm still... well, I, yeah, it doesn't really help. You guys, I was going to say, I can, you guys can still uh, suggest other builds you would like to see. There were a couple more that I have in store, I guess. Uh, as I said last time, one person said, uh, like, old no country for old men. That's definitely still one that I want to do. Again, though, I think I would do Liu Biao, uh, Huang Zhong, and then Tao Qian. But, we'll see. Cool fucking volley right there. Rage units act really weirdly in this mode as well. In the way that they just kind of shoot uh, only when you are, like, five feet away from them, basically. Alrighty, well, I think, yeah, we'll all go for the speed. Speed this shit up. Fast that. All right. But yeah, I think I'm also going to do some random battles and stuff. I want to do a, a video specifically on... Um, well, not like, an ex like, not, not like an educational video or something, but just a video for fun. On um, the... Uh, on the Cataphract units, because I really like the Cataphract units. I think they're actually a really nice addition to the game. Um... It's not like uh, Lance Cav and Spear Cav is really missing anything, to be fair. They already had a pretty wide variety of units, so... Oh, nice. I slaughtered that unit. Um, but even so, like, if anything, uh, melee Cav should get some extra units, but, you know... As far as I know right now, that's not gonna happen, but hey, there's definitely still something that... Or, I'm, I'm, there, there will stuff definitely still be adding more to the base game at some point. That's one of the complaints I saw about the Eight Princes DLC as well, is that... Like, we didn't ask for this, so would have preferred if you stayed in the Free Kingdoms period and added more to that game. I'm like, well... They never said they won't. They, uh, in fact, they were quite clear that they were definitely going to expand more on the base game as well, so... I want to get that one, and I want to get that one. Unfortunately, you don't have... I guess you get the melee. Alright, I guess also save your point instead. Um, it's a boss wave right now, so we can buy either one of those. Oh yeah, so you already start with that one, I believe. The decreased cooldown of abilities. You get that one too. You as well. If we get all three of those, and then we get our uh, arrow storm, we can actually arrow storm the shit out of everyone constantly. Is there any point saving your one point? Probably not. Let's just get that one too. We could go for the rate resistance, but that's better on Tsa Because Tsa tends to be the guy up front, because he's faster than everyone else. If only a little bit, but still. You can see him going up ahead, uh, in front there as well. When, you, when it's on long runs, he tends to be the one that ends up in front for sure. Oh man, we're taking some damage. 
You're taking some fucking damage, boys. I don't like it. We gotta actually be careful now because we're getting to the point where, since we have no healing, we got we actually do need to be rather careful. Good jump. I approve. Also nice that we have free bows. Again, bows can do quite a decent bit of damage. Oh, it's uh, the Abanus friend. Hello. Fucking use all the shittiest abilities in the world. And then get away. We barely even wounded anyone. <laughs> what a disgrace. No, the volley. Okay, that was actually kind of pathetic. Get in there. No, 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 no. Ugh. No, 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 no! Are we gonna die right now? I feel like I'm not. Oh, yeah, actually, Xiao Yun. Wow, he went down like a fucking sack of potatoes. Potatoes! Boil them, mash them, stick them to stew. Take this, Liu Bei. Get away from me. Liu Bei, you're not welcome here, man. I need to buy you after this, to be honest. Thing is, if I buy a heal now... Oh man, Su Chuan is fucking dead. Jeez, I did not realize that. Okay, yeah, if I buy a heal, I won't be able to buy one of these level 5 skills before the next boss fight, but... I guess that's okay. I seriously need to heal. <laughs> um, let me take the range block chance on everyone, too. I didn't really want to waste a point on this, but sure. Yeah, you're gonna buy a heal as well. Everyone's gonna go for a heal right now. This is the problem with this um, this group of dudes. They don't have any healing whatsoever. They have some damage protection though. I gotta get that 50%. But that's only when you get below 20%, I think. Which doesn't really help that much. Fucking get them, boys. We also become worse when we get below 50%. Like, quite a bit worse, in fact. Because we lose, of course, our melee attack range. 100% uh, bonus, which is pretty big. To lose that. Are you gonna... Go on, get shot. There you go. Shot, 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 shot. I don't know if that was worth it. Maybe we should have just charge them in. Get away from me, Cav. I think I care about you. Maybe I should do another uh, triple trouble at some point, but I need three actual characters for that that make sense to be with each other. We already used the Sun Children. I mean, which other three characters out, out there make super sense? I mean, Liu Bei, Guan Yu, and Zhang Fei, I suppose. Yeah, we're good. Maybe even Cao Cao, Xiao Hu Dun, Xiao Hu Yuan. They kind of make a lot of sense to be together as well, but... I don't know. I feel like... Uh, in reality, the, the three children are the ones who really... There's a, I mean, there's probably other challenges we could do as well. There's quite a bit you can do with this mode. Which is what I do like about it. There's obviously like a lot of different uh, sizes that I haven't even touched yet. Although I feel like the, the problem I tend to have with this kind of thing is that I, I'm a black and white kind of person in real life too. So I always feel like I either go all the way or I go all the way lowest. So right now I'm on 100%. But like why would I go on 300% or 400% right if I could just go 600%? Like why would I go really big but not the biggest that there is? I never, I don't know, I just can't, I can't really figure that out for myself. Like, why would I make X decision if I can make Y decision, right? But anyway, it's definitely something that we can still do. Are you serious? Okay, there we go. Right, um, so yeah, we do get this 20%, uh, when below 20%, 50% damage resistance, which is pretty good, but I don't care about that. I, yeah, I'll pick up one of these right now, I think. And then, you guys, yeah, we only need one of those, we don't need more, so I guess you guys are going to save up, actually. I could buy this buff, but again, it only enabled if you're not gauged to melee, which is just absolutely pointless. I'm going to go for the uh, arrow storm with the other dudes, I think. Alright, we got uh, Xu Xu, Sun Jian, and Dong Zhou. I mean, we have a couple of fucking losers. Oh no, you didn't actually survive, alright. Don't shoot me, man. What the hell's wrong with you? Why would you do something like that to me? There we go, they're gone. Look, go kill this man. 
who I've heard many good things about. I still, I think I haven't even ever seen him in a campaign yet, which is kind of interesting. I have played a decent amount of this is actually, at this point already, my second most played Total War game. Which sounds weird, although that is counting, of course, uh, Sugar 2 and Fallout Sarmai in one, otherwise I think Fallout Sarmai would still be my second most played. But yeah, if you only count, uh, if you count them separately, or sorry, if you count them together, which I do because they are the same game on Steam, um, then uh, yeah, this game is now my second played, second most played Total War game. Already, it's only come out a couple months ago. I was a bit surprised when I saw it actually, because I thought like I had played quite a bit of some other Total War games as well. But I mean, I have. It's just not as much as this one. I have what 300 and something hours in this now. Um, I believe 300 and like 50 or something. And then I have obviously got like 1800 hours or something in Shogun 2. Oh god, Satsa is getting fucking destroyed. Satsa, get out of there! No. Use that speed of yours. Get in here and murder these people. Man, Tata almost got wrecked there. Get back in there. Get off Tata. Don't attack Tata. No, 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 no. Oh my god, he's so low. 2.8k. That could have gone horribly wrong. Let's get a heal for you. You guys are going to both get that, I think. Yeah, you're both fine on HP. Plus, I could heal if I wanted to, but I don't want to. Okay. Um, why is that unit? Oh, we got. I guess we started shooting at it right away. But yeah, anyway, so yeah, because I was kind of confused because I did quite a bit of Rome too. I mean, I didn't play too many campaigns at a base game, but I played some co-op stuff. I played uh, a lot of Divide and, and Impera. I did like four campaigns on that. Although I only ever finished one, the um, Armenia one. That was a really, really fun campaign, though. I really liked that mod actually. Um. And then they changed it and became too complicated for me. I am a lowly idiot. <laughs> now, I don't know. I don't know if you guys ever play Divided Impera on um, on Rome 2. But basically, right now, from what I've seen, it's got, it's got like all kinds of different populations and stuff. And there's supplies. The supplies were already a thing back when I played it. But it wasn't as confusing as it is now. I don't know. It just they, I feel like they went a little bit overboard with it. It's just too difficult. It's also the problem I have with... People ask me this all the time as well. I guess we're going into all kinds of different subjects right now, but that's okay. Um, I need to get one of these, so why don't you pick that one up? Oh, you should have saved up for that. Actually, should have been someone else that picked that one up. Yeah, whatever. Um, the same goes for uh, Master Strategy Mod, I think it's called, for Shogun 2. People... I, I, don't, I couldn't tell you how many people have asked me to play that mod. And I did play it at one point, actually, and I thought it was okay. I don't like the fact that it uses Extended Japan, because, as I've said so many times in my life on this channel, um, I don't like Extended Japan. I, the reason I like Shogun 2 so much, and also partially the reason why I like Three Kingdoms so much, is because the campaigns don't take six generations to finish. I don't have to ask my great-great-great-grandchildren to finish these campaigns for me, like with Mortal Empires, for example. I can do it myself in a reasonable amount of time. Um, ooh, Pearl Dragons get fucked, boys. So, the reason that's the reason why I don't like Extended Japan, because it makes the campaign so much longer, and at a certain point, there's just, you know, you want to move on, you want to play something else. I just don't, I don't see any appeal of playing a campaign for that long, personally. So anyway, um... So that's, uh, that's one of the reasons why I, I didn't play Moss or uh, Master Strategy, but that was not exactly what I was trying to say. Moss or Master Strategy also um, was different. It was, it was I, I quite liked it at a certain point. I thought it was okay. Definitely worth playing. And then they updated it again, and I don't actually even really remember what happened, but they seem to have made that one way more extensive and such as well, to the point where it's like, well... I don't want to play this anymore. This doesn't look like fun. There's just too much to think about. I'm gonna heal you actually because I don't want to risk this. Like there's just there there it just became too complicated and complicated is not always good. This is why I always say more is not always better. Sometimes less is more, right? This is again why I like Shogun 2 so much as well is because the units um, units that are available are all really good. They're all really well balanced. Almost every single unit has a use basically. Whereas if you take Rome. 2 or, or Attila or whatever other more recent Total War game that isn't uh, Warhammer or Free Kingdoms. You have so many units that feel 
or that that are named different and that are supposed to be different, but they feel exactly the same. And it just doesn't like the, there's supposedly unit variety, but it, there there isn't really, and it just I don't know, it just feels bad to me, personally. I honestly don't even know where I'm going anymore with this whole conversation, but <laughs> I'm, just, I, I'm just saying things that I think, and I'm sure some of you will be interested in the things that I say. Um, but anyway. So Moss and Divided and Para uh, all went overboard, and that's why I don't play them. That's basically... Uh, now, oh, right, this all, started, this all started with me saying that this is not my second most played Total War game. So that's that's why, um, yeah, because because uh, I played a bunch of Rome two, and I would have possibly played more had they not changed the um, the Vitam at Impera mod too much. Because I, I wouldn't play it anymore, and it like as a base game right now. I just I don't have any interest in it. Same goes for Attila. Fuck me, Leo Bay is gonna die. Get out! Holy fuck, he got wrecked there. All right, it's gonna run around shooting people, I guess. We have a bow. We ought to use it, right? I don't know how much damage that does. Didn't even seem to kill him. So not that much, I'd say. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, when they get caught in there, they do get kind of stunned, but even then... Okay, well, we're shooting, and it actually... Shooting does seem to do a decent amount of damage. What are you... Don't shoot over there. Shoot over here. Don't move. Just shoot. You don't have to move for that. Hey, we got one. I could probably just send the other ones in, to be honest. We're not that weak. Yo, weak. Oh yeah, this is what I want. You're the one that I want. Kill him. Legolas! Legolas! <laughs> Fuck's sake, Legolas. Oh, we got him. Oh, I'll stun him. Shoot him! God. Well, the obey did the killing blow too. Alright, you need a heal, I, uh, I'm afraid to say. Uh, you're gonna save up, and you are gonna get the deep, the decrease cooldown as well, I think. Yeah, let's cool down the shit out of everything. Cool the fuck down, boys. Honestly, uh, Sun Chuan and Cao Cao aren't that well off either, to be honest. But it's okay. We are about halfway in time-wise. Still a lot more to do. We're only row 13, so once again, we're not going to make this. I think, honestly, the thing with this mode now is that I... I mean, I said this a few times already as well, but I, I honestly don't care anymore about the scores. I'm never going to get that first place, and I... I'm competitive, but I'm not that competitive, right? I know what to give up. So at this point, I really, really just don't care anymore, and I, I, I do wonder if people... Would have commented by now, because again, I'm I'm way I'm like five episodes ahead of this or something, or five videos, it's not really episodes. Um, but I do wonder if people would have commented by now saying like, well, if you're not going to play for the score, then why even bother, or something. Maybe you guys have, maybe you guys haven't. I I honestly don't know. Um, but the point is that I um, I'm just really like because if I obviously if I wanted to do better, I would not play like this. I would play well normal speed, but even double speed I could still do. But I would have to send everyone in different directions and stuff, and I'm just not doing that. Alright, you're gonna pick up that one. You're gonna pick up that debuff. You're gonna pick up absolutely nothing. Alright, I've got another heal in before next wave, but that's okay. Right, so we have the insane cooldown now. You know what? I'm gonna sit in the middle. I'm gonna try something here. I may have to kill the cab units as they come at me, but other than that, I'm gonna sit here. I'm gonna gather up every single unit of infantry. I need to get further this way because there's one of them all the way over there. A couple units coming from coming from there as well, though. Coming, 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 coming from there. All right, let's kill the calf. Ugh, I heard that. <laughs> what the fuck was that? All right, kill this fucking calf here. Don't kill the infantry. I want to get out because I don't actually. I I don't want to hit the infantry. I want to. Have as many infantry units available as possible. Let's just kind of walk in circles around them. Till they all gather up, essentially. Okay, we're almost there. Just this one over here. Oh, fuck, there's a crossbow unit firing. Alright, here we go. 
There we go. Boom. Oh, fuck that one. Boom. Oh my god, South Star is almost dead. Alright, was that good? I mean, it did a decent bit of damage. Did it do enough, though? Definitely almost killed South Star without even getting any time to do my abilities yet. That's why you need slow mo or normal speed, I guess. That was pretty cool. I like that. I like the thousands of corpses that are on the ground here. That's my kind of jam, boys. <laughs> Alright, I need to heal up. Uh, and I'm gonna take a heal with you as well. And you can see, save your one point. Yeah, the cooldown on these abilities is fucking short as heck, son. So that's nice. I'm gonna do the same thing again. Sit here and... In the middle of this hill. Shooting at everything. Charging the Dong. Charging Sun Tzu. Charging Xiao Hudun. Charging Xiao Yu. Charging Zhuge Liang. That's it for the charging. Alright, let's get out. Get out, get out! I don't want to be this far back. Oh my god, I'm getting fucking shot to pieces. The Abe is going to die in this one. No, Liu Bei. Don't you do it. There is still so much to live for. Fuck yes. I don't know if I'm doing anything, but I'm not really dying, so it's probably good. God, there's so much shit there, though. Alright, so I just took a bunch of damage, too. And now we just gotta wait, like, 20 seconds, and this cooldown will be back already, because that's how fast it is. Did we kill? No, we didn't kill a single general, though. But every other unit is gathered up now, so... Alright, let's get back in here. Alright, this actually works pretty well. Again, it's not the fastest way to do it. But it's actually not bad. Oh god, the base is gonna die. Ah! Get out, get out! Okay, I'm gonna send you back in, except for you. You can sit here firing at him. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Oh, that's the wrong one to use that with. Oh, I've got it back again. Fire at him. That missed entirely. Oh. Fucking kill your older brother, man. We're not doing so hot. Are you even being... Oh, okay, he's getting shot. Oh, they're all sitting still now. Well, you know, in that case... <laughs> Just sit here. All right, this is what this is where the range build starts working well. When the enemies don't come towards you anymore, oof. Then it's a great build. Although, oh, nice snipe on on the dong right there by uh, Liu Bei. Stop shooting that unit. There's a fucking general there. Oh, sir, what the hell are you even firing at, guys? Why would you kill this guy? <laughs> what is wrong with you? We're we gonna get him though. Now I'm interested. Oh, he got away because the angle. Oh, no, oh, he's still firing. Okay, no, he's, he's gone away. Alright, there goes one of the generals. Now we're fighting uh, Xiao, Yu, Xiao Yu, or shooting at Xiao Yu. And then Xiao Hudun. 4.6, 2.7, 1.8, and he's dead! Alright. <laughs> That's actually quite fun. I, again, I do really like the range stuff. It's just not that effective, unfortunately. Uh, your health is okay to go one more round. I definitely want to get that. Uh, you need to get a, a heal, I'm afraid. And then do I save up for another... No, we don't need more buff, so... Why don't we take this melee attack rate, I guess. And you, my good friend, need a heal as well. <laughs> this is fucking corpse falls to the ground there. What the fuck? That was crazy. That was crazy! Okay, well, this wave's too easy to just sit in the middle. Let's go murder them. Oh. Let's, uh... Go murder them in melee, actually. Kill the shit in here. Get fucking wrecked, son. Another one. Another one. And this mercenary infantry unit. Ah. It is satisfying still. I kind of wish you were... Well, I guess you could... I, I do actually wonder if people are going to make mods, or maybe already have done, for this mode, where essentially what happens is, um, like, maybe someone mods in the fact that uh, generals become way, 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 way stronger, where you can 
Uh, like, maybe they just have, like, I don't know, an extra 2,000% melee attack range or something. Like, I legitimately think that that would be quite fun to do, just as a one-off thing. Obviously, you don't get the points for it, because when you use mods, your uh, score is disabled. But it'd be fun. Just uh, charge into a unit, and then, the f like, you charge a unit here, and then a unit over here, here, and there all die as well, because of the stupid attack range. I've seen mods for that, like, in... Um Age of Empires 2, actually. Uh, I don't know if you guys ever watched Spirit of the Law. Hi guys, Spirit of the Law here. Um, let's save the points, you can get a heal. Eh, no, actually, I'll, I'll wait. and save that until the next, uh, before the next boss wait. But yeah, he, um, those are Age of Empires 2 videos. I'm sure many of you will have seen him. Or have all seen his videos. Um, but yeah, that's the thing in, uh, in that game. That there's a mod where uh, the what do you call them the the rams siege rams they have like um, I don't know like a several like a, a several dozen tile range uh, attack range basically so he's got this like a uh, small gif almost uh, in his intro I think it is where um, uh, one of the rams attacks a wall and then buildings and units like way behind the wall just fall over and die. Yeah, that, kind of, that kind of idea is what I have with this as well. And so if you just attack, if I charge, jump into this unit, that unit over there just falls over and dies. Every wave cleared in a single second, basically. <laughs> I think that'd be fun. I do wonder if someone actually ha already has a mod like that. I wouldn't be surprised that someone made a sp specific mod with that in mind. But I don't know. Oh, that was horrible. What was I thinking there? Alright. This Azure Dragon's... Oh my god. They're pretty cool, I was gonna say. And then they died. And then they all died. Seriously, this one mercenary axe, dude? Okay. Right, so... I want to get a heal on you. The rest is fine. Although I wouldn't be surprised if someone dies this round. You're gonna save up for... Some... Thing. There's not really much to save up for anymore. Why don't you just get that melee attack rate? Alright, we're gonna sit in the middle again and just. Uh... Oh, we got this two characters from before. Tao Chan was there before as well. Gan Ning hadn't shown up yet. Oh, and there's Guan Yu. The one who ruins everything. Yeah, we'll sit in the middle. Man, it's the fucking generals coming for me. Look at this, six generals coming at me live. Get in here. Also, I'm pretty sure I'm not using my camera mod, but I feel like I'm be able to zoom out further than before. Man, I don't know. Need to get the hell out of there because we will die. Stay in there for too long. I want to get my archer stuff off. We've got most of the units here. There weren't actually that many cav units here, except for the generals, I suppose, but it's not exactly the same. Oh. Ooh, this is pretty pretty well bunched up already. Alrighty then. Oh god, the frames. The children! Think of the children! I don't even know who I'm attacking these things with, but I'm just doing them around directions. Okay, let's get out. That was mildly effective. Again, the cooldown is so short that we should be uh, able to do it again soon. Do you obey? You need to get the fuck out of there, man. Shit, you're getting fucking wrecked over here. Shit, it's just kind of stationary. Well, prepare to die. So we didn't charge into it. It wasn't even facing our way. Alright, Leo Bay, you might very well die here, but let's do this. Leroy and Jenkins and that. Fucking do it. Leo Bay, get out. Perhaps you will survive. You're a survivor. Yes. Now these other guys are gonna die. Oh no! Sun Chuan, you're gonna die! <laughs> Shit! I overestimated <laughs> your ability to stay in there and kill everyone. Alright. Apparently you are totally fine. I don't know how you're doing it, but... Why can you kill these generals? Get back. Actually, you know what? We might be able to get to the point where they all stand still and don't chase me again. That's the, that's the point I want to reach. 
fucking Gan Ning's chasing heavily after me now. Well, he's gonna get fucking shot, isn't he? Stop shooting those units. I gotta get away from the units so we shoot only him. Where's the edge? Oh, there we go. There's the edge. Oh, he's standing still. Well, he stood still and he paid for it. Is we okay? Somehow, yeah, we were shooting Guan Yu instead of this guy. Well, he goes down as well. And there, Tao, Tao Qian. And he's gone. All right. We got five and a half minutes left over. What can we do? I don't want that disgusting buff. Uh, we already have both of those, do we not? Uh, wait, no, you don't. We don't have this one. Speed and ranged. No, all right. Well, you can pick that one up then. You are gonna save your final. Actually, nobody to heal. Oh God, the obey. Um. Well, this will be interesting. Uh. Fine. Let's take this as well. Why not? And you need to heal as well, actually. Okay, so we're gonna have to save Lia Bay here. Oh god. Is it Lia Bay who's the first one in melee? Get him out of here. Hashtag save Lia Bay. Don't get him in melee. Get it? Because it, it rhymes. <laughs> mm. Get in there. I'm gonna play all risk, all reward with Lia Bay right here. Charge him in. Oh, oh, he's gonna charge in here first. Oh god, don't kill him. Don't do it. Get him out of there. I'm not. I don't care. Lia Bay, do it. Save him. Shoot around Lia Bay. Don't let anyone near him. <laughs> Another one. No leave How much HP has he got now? 3.7. Oh, he's gonna be fine. Alright, that's those two units gone. Here we go. The final challenge for Lia Bay. Stand still right in front of them. Just to make it even riskier. Oh, I think he survived. Lia Bay, a legend. Take that. And we don't need to heal everyone else, so. All right, final wave, perhaps wave twenty. Yeah, I mean we made it. It's better. That's more to be said than uh, what we did with the last one, which surprises me a little bit actually. These guys have surprising survivability. Maybe I played a little bit more safe, but I'm not sure. Last time we had two green characters, which are both heavy support characters that I can also apparently tank quite a bit. They have all of HP. That didn't go too well, and I was on the same um, same size, so that's not. Any difference or anything? I don't know why that one actually went so poorly. It was a day ago, so you can't expect me to, <laughs> to remember. Alright, see you later, yellow dragons. Is there a story behind the yellow dragons, by the way? Because I feel like all yellow stuff, like whenever there's a word yellow, it has to do with yellow turban rebels. But the yellow... Um, Yellow dragons are available to Han factions, like normal factions. So I'm a little bit confused about that. Pew 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 pew. Pwah. I'm trying to um, reenact one of those like rides at a at a fun fair, but it or like one of those horns. But it didn't come out exactly right, so... Excuse me. Right, we got a couple seconds left. We're gonna actually be able to get into the next wave, I think. Because we get an extra 10 seconds. I know, there's something alive somewhere? Or maybe the game... Normally you get to go into the next... Well, normally you get an extra 10 seconds, which we did now as well. Um, but I guess because we hadn't quite cleared the wave yet, it just left the 10 seconds in that wave. Interesting. Anyway, uh, Leo Bay was a fucking loser compared to everyone else. Nice increments of 2,000, though. Alright, well, that was pathetic. But hey, there you go. There was the Wu Wei Shu Han um, alliance. And it was crap. But hey, we all expected that. Again, feel free to comment what you want to see next. Again, also, by the time you comment, I will be on holiday. But perhaps I'll do more of these when I get back from holiday. It wouldn't. I wouldn't put it past myself. For now, though, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Until next time, have a good day and goodbye.